Researchers are making the connection between vitamin D and your weight. Now, they recently found an association between low vitamin D levels and weight gain in older women. Mm. And we looked into what this could mean for you and your waistline. It's another January day in the Rose City, meaning little vitamin D is coming from the sky. It's been associated with lower cancer risk, fighting common colds, and even reducing the risk of multiple sclerosis. And people living here know they probably lack it. Being a, you know, native Pacific Northwesterner, you know that you need your vitamin D because <laughs> we don't get enough from the sun. Um, I have supplements. I don't take them very regularly. Yeah. I get my vitamin D through my diet, although I should take the vitamin D supplement, supplements according to my doctor. And now even more reason. Researchers at Kaiser Permanente in Portland have evidence it could also ward off extra LBs in older women on average about two and a half pounds. Doesn't sound significant, but it is. On a sort of population basis over many years, this potentially could signal that vitamin D is playing an important role in body weight regulation. For nearly five years, study author Aaron LeBlanc tracked 4,600 women ages 65 and older. LeBlanc and other researchers discovered that those with insufficient vitamin D levels gained more weight than women who had enough vitamin D. There are a few theories as to why the vitamin could work to fight weight gain. There is some evidence that vitamin D could be regulating how we um, put on fat or take off fat. LeBlanc says the next step is a study where they would give some women a placebo and others a vitamin D supplement for more evidence. They need that evidence before recommending supplements to keep people from gaining weight. Although most people realize a supplement alone won't keep off extra pounds. People that are deprived of the sun, they might think that they need to just take extra vitamin D just to compensate, but I think that a balance of exercise and diet and staying on top of your health and talking to your doctor about it is probably the best way to go. Yeah, do you like how everyone in that video... Everyone's wearing jackets. jackets. Yeah, that was today. It's we late that June. Today. We're wearing mm -hmm. jackets. Right, and hey, you know, with all the benefits of vitamin D, I mean, they talk about it all the time. Mm -hmm. This is miracle vitamin. Wouldn't hurt to take a supplement if you feel like you are deficient. Doctors say it's very hard to get to toxic levels of it. Uh, you really have to take a lot of it for an That's extended period of time. I take it. I, I was deficient. I take it now, too. <laughs> so there you go.